All right, I just got back from Dallas, Texas, where we had another Amazon seller meetup. That was my fourth one, I think. It was so much fun. I absolutely love hanging out with you guys and just getting to know you a little bit more. It is so much fun. So uh, we flew in on Wednesday, which um, if you're from Texas, you already know this, but the thunderstorms will roll in and sometimes they last a while. So I kept getting delayed, 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 but we eventually made it. We just hung out on Thursday and then on Friday I hit the ground running and I actually went and did one-on-one -on -one sourcing with Joanne. <laughs> community before she's been in the bolo group in the past i've done my one-on-one -on -one coaching with her so this was almost just like an extension and another session but in real life and in the future meetups i'm absolutely going to do them again so in philadelphia in june i will have one-on-one -on -one sessions available actually the day of the meetup so that saturday morning you can go to yoursellingguide.com meetup if you want to book that if you can't go to the meetup though, I also have one-on-one -on -one coaching available throughout the year, so you can book that as well. That's all on my website. But anyways, I have so much fun sourcing with other people. So you guys already know this, but I source alone. I've been sourcing alone the whole time. Um, I'm an introvert, shocking, but I'm an introvert anyway, so it's always like, I'm in my groove sourcing, right? Doing retail arbitrage, but it's so much fun. I actually learn from them just as much as they're learning from me. So this was my second one-on-one -on -one sourcing I think I've done, um, or maybe third, but it was really great because we make the most of that hour. So we started out at all my favorites. So we go through the health and beauty, we go to toys. She was showing me some of her products that she's been selling really well. I'm showing her some of the products that I've been selling that are doing really well. And you just get this whole like list of ideas that you maybe didn't think of before. It's very much, you are, if you've seen any of my sourcing videos, you are right there with me and we're going sourcing. So definitely consider doing that if you want to in the Philadelphia meetup. But anyways, so after that Friday night, um, we had a pre meetup meetup for anyone who was in town early and wanted to make it. We went to the rodeo bar and grill. I have no photos or videos from that because we were just enjoying each other's company and I totally forgot to record anything. So I got nothing to show you there except for these drinks, which were delicious, but that was from a scouting trip the day before. Anyways, I, if you ever, okay, here's the deal. So when I worked in corporate America, like you would go to the happy hours with your coworkers and stuff. And you know, I, again, I'm an introvert, so it was always a little nerve wracking me, but I had my office um, bestie that I would go with and that made it a little bit better. But since we work on our own and we're Amazon sellers, we don't have that like coworker aspect really. You might have your spouse or friend, aunt, sister, cousin, whoever maybe is helping you on the business. But outside of that, we really don't have that coworker mentality. And even as an introvert, it is really necessary and needed to have those connections. So I love doing the podcast where I chat with you guys. I love hanging out in the Facebook groups, but most of all, I've been loving these one-on-one -on -one coaching calls. I've been loving meeting everyone in person at the meetups. We all sell differently. So like Scott, he sells in books and he is an OA book master, okay? I can't even wrap my head around selling books, let alone OA books, and he's doing amazing at it. You just never know who you're gonna talk to and all it starts with is, you sell on Amazon, so do I. What kind of things do you sell? How do you do it? And you're gonna learn so much just because there's so many different ways, even though we're all doing the same thing, there's so many different ways to do it. So Saturday on the meetup, we headed over to Electric Shuffle.
had food, we had drinks, we played shuffleboard. Um, I was not very good at it, but I did get the hang of it after a little while. It's just an amazing time of chatting with other sellers. So there was um, some people come on their own and you just meet someone there. Some people bring their spouse or their business partner. It's just whatever you wanna do, really, anyone and everyone is welcome at these meetups. You do have to be over 21 just cause it's a bar, but other than that, anyone is welcome to join them. So our next one is gonna be in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, June 8th, that's a Saturday. And like I said, I'm gonna have the one-on-ones available ahead of time and then we'll do, um, we're gonna do an escape room and then we'll have like a happy hour afterwards. Um, all of that as of this recording is still TBD, but by the time this video comes out, it will all be set and ready to go. So you'll have all the information uh, right there ready for you. I'm really looking forward to it. You guys know I love Grocery Outlet and guess what? They have Grocery Outlet in Pennsylvania. So if you wanna take a trip, see like there's a ton of the nation's history up there. The Liberty Bell is right there. Um, there's like a couple different museums I'm gonna check out that Friday. So there's a lot of stuff to do there. And I always like the meetup is on Saturday, but if you happen to be traveling or you're in town earlier, I always go, once I get there, I'll find a little place where you can all hang out if we want to, and you're welcome to join. But there's a Facebook chat where everyone is hanging out before and after, all as a part of your ticket, your RSVP to the meetup. So I hope you to see you there. This meetup was an absolute success, and I cannot wait for the next one because I love just chatting with everyone and meeting you guys and everyone is amazing. Everyone is so nice and friendly and you need that community to help you when things get tough, when you're struggling, like currently it's a little bit of a struggle selling on Amazon at the moment and you can like commiserate and get ideas and just sometimes if you're just down in the dumps on it for whatever reason, it happens, take a break. But talking to other people, hearing what they're doing, knowing they're going through the same thing, it just gives you a little bit of a reinvigoration to get out there and continue to sell on Amazon after maybe a little bit break. Everyone needs a break every now and again, and we created this business and job for ourselves for that purpose to be able to have that freedom. So yeah, I look forward to seeing you guys all in Philadelphia, the meetup. I'm still on a high for it. It was just so much fun. So I can't wait to see you there. And thank you to everyone who came out to the Dallas meetup. It was an absolute blast and yeah, super excited for the next one.